What you doing? I'm researching. Yes, it might seem like we only report on news when it's days old, but sometimes we're right at the cutting edge, and it just takes us two days to do the editing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so, I mean, technically, this is all brand new news that you haven't heard about, but we have just uncovered. It looks like Casey Eric is trying to get Nick deposed. Bum, bum, bum. Breaking news. Bum, bum, bum. We did it first. Ka, ka, ka. Maybe we didn't. Yeah. Let's keep the intro. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of DNA Crows. I'm Andrew, your host, the Comic Crow, and this is Dean. It's been so long since we've been able to do our proper introduction. That, it uh, is a proper introduction until you say something oh, about it. Yeah, well, that it. It's one to point out to the viewers: I, it was gone for a little bit. I was about ready to claw out my own throat. It was. Uh, I'm always unbearable. ready to claw out your throat. Yeah, no, but you're. Yeah. You're just a horrible person. Or or a horrible bird. No, I'm a hero. I would be a hero. <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, in case anyone is still unaware of this uh, late and breaking news that uh, we're, we're covering first, we're just taking mm-hmm. very long to edit, um, it looks like uh, they, they basically want to get Nick to uh, give deposition. Um, from what I read, it was uh, they, they wanted him to do like a video deposition, mm-hmm. and uh, Nick covered this on his uh, show already. Uh, basically, it sounds like they were really upset about the GoFundMe money. Yeah, yeah. And uh, when they said that they were going to depose him uh, by video, Nick said on his show like, oh, "No, they they're going to come to me." <laughs> they can depose me over here in uh, Minnesota. Man. It's like, damn. Man. <laughs> hey, well, Nick Nick does know the law better than us, so I'm just like, do no, it, man. I don't even think he's a lawyer. He's an internet lawyer. Blackface lawyer. Blackface internet lawyer. YouTube. YouTube lawyer. Blackface internet YouTube Okay, lawyer. well, a real question. Would you rather be a YouTube lawyer or a podcast lawyer? Um, YouTube lawyer? Yeah, probably YouTube lawyer. Yeah. I mean, only because I know who the YouTube lawyer is and the podcast lawyer. Do you know, audience? Do you know who these lawyers are? Um, I, I hope so. Or anyways. would you rather be a homeless man who eats shoes? Ooh. Wait, wait. Is the choice podcast lawyer or the homeless man who eats shoes? Mm-hmm. I don't know, audience. You tell us which one's worse. I, I, I actually, I don't know. It's hard, right? I think uh, homeless man who eats shoes is a little more likable than podcast lawyer. Yeah, in, in not a, like he's likable in a pathetic kind of way, but like, like I'd feel, rather deal with him. Yeah, you feel so sorry for that guy, mm-hmm. and you know he's completely harmless because, uh, I mean, look, 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 he he's, he's, he's eating his own <laughs> shoes. Yeah. That 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 ain't that that that's not now. You wouldn't even no. worry about leave like have to worry about leaving food out near him no, like you do with your friends. You know what I mean? Like you're like, but hey. you would have to worry about taking off your shoes around. Yeah. The guy. yeah, yeah. So if you live in an Asian household, oh my god, it's terrible. Things are dangerous. Yeah, well, that's yeah. a real problem. Um, yeah, he gets invited over for like dinner, and uh, he. <laughs> Everyone's at the table. They're like, we're, we're, we're shameless. Potlucks are the worst. Oh my god! <laughs> he brings over like a fucking shit ton of shoes. Everybody else brings real food. It's fucking weird. It's like boiled leather, like spread over paper bags. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. So he's he's basically said he won't uh, he he won't make it e- easy on them mm-hmm. if they want to depose him. They have to come out to Minnesota. He is not flying out to see them. Um, yeah, and that's if the uh, motion to get him deposed can even pass because it really does sound like they're on like a fishing expedition, which mm-hmm. um, most courts, as I understand it, don't want people doing that. Yeah, but I mean, sometimes people get away with it. Yeah, it does happen. Yes. But I guess I'm it, it, I'm no legal expert at all. It just doesn't seem like the sort of thing the court wants happening. It could it could still go through. But if you read their uh, paperwork on it, and again, Nick's pointed this out too, um, I believe. You know, I don't know if he's 
He hasn't actually hasn't done his. He hasn't covered it. He hasn't. He hasn't. He hasn't done his podcast yet, folks. Yeah. So we, we don't even know. We we heard we heard this late in breaking from Kiwi Farm. So. <laughs> um. Yeah. No. So. They have to actually pass, uh, or, or get the motion to actually get him deposed passed. Mm-hmm. Um, weird thing they tried to dox him with the uh, documents so he just like threw it out there shameless did yeah and uh obviously uh everyone would immediately pointed out the hypocrisy of doing that Mm -hmm. uh to nick when you've complained time and time again about how nick is going to dox people um uh ty is going to talk or going to dox people and then you take the guy that you hate you, you you throw out his address turns out it's not his actual address um they they throw that out to the public and nobody says a single word they just all cheer it on like it's all yeah well because, I mean they hate the guy and they don't have tried, any principles but they I mean people have no, tried to dox them no I, I know but what I mean is they just hate the guy and they have no yeah. principles so so when they complain about doxing and everything it's only for them it really is only for them yeah and they'll do the same thing it's not about whether it's right or wrong it's, li- it's literally about who's doing it mm-hmm. if they're doing it well, obviously, it's okay and acceptable because the other side are terrible, horrible, mean people. Yeah. And if you're doing it, well, it's proof that you are a terrible, horrible, mean person. They're justified in doing this shit to yeah. you. It's a moral thing. It's a moral <laughs> thing. I mean, it's it's really, uh, it really is a moral thing. But you're dealing with immoral people, so yeah, not really. It, I'd, I'd be different if they were like, oh, we believe that Nick should be doxxed but we also don't care about people being doxxed go ahead dox people that'd be different i'd be like okay if or that was your stance screaming out about yeah. the potential doxing of people if that was your stance that like doxing's cool no matter what totally all right like i could I, it's not that i agree but i could i wouldn't think that you're yeah no it, it, it being a hypocrite you, yeah but when you're sitting there screaming your heads off going up and down they got to release the name of victims and then you go ahead and release the, 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 the name and address of somebody that you have a personal gripe with, that you accuse of, the, of of wanting to do this behavior, but then you actually engage in doing it, like sharing the document around, mm. uh, making sure gotta, nothing's blocked out. remember, I mean, this guy eats shoes. Yeah. <laughs> like, I guess here's the thing. You're asking for, for, for shameless, lot. I mean, it's like you can't teach an old doc new tricks instead of an old dog you just have an old pathetic dude well, who's actually you know what he's I'll give him this he's accidentally doxxed <laughs> oh my god um wh- who was it Ron Toy I think it was Monica and Braun he, yeah. he accidentally doxxed because he just threw the document out right away I forget because it's been so long but my, my point isn't shameless because we all know he's an idiot this was probably completely unintentional he just goofed up that's what I'm saying <laughs> But it's for the people they're cheering it on as it happens and acting like this is some sort of major win getting Nick Ricada's address. Again, like I said, it turns out it's not his address, so that's great. Mm-hmm. Um, but it, it really shows you the mindset of the group that you're dealing with. It's completely dishonest, and any outrage is completely phony because they don't actually care about the action. They just care about the fact that you're doing it. Yeah, I agree. Um, yeah. I now, I, I guess the only real question is, hmm. and we got to ask this during the stream. Hmm. Uh, I don't know if you remember, but um, what do you think is going to happen if they actually get Nick to post? I don't think anything. I think it's a. I think they think it's a threat. Um, I don't think anything. I I think it'll be funny. Yeah, I think I, I think Nick would demand that they do it at his residence and then stream it. <laughs> Take super chats. I don't think that's legal. <laughs> well, actually, I think it might be because I I think he has the right to be filmed. He has the right to be filmed, but I think it has to go through proper channels. No, you just need the lawyers there in the room. I mean, I could be completely no, well, wrong. Because you got to but... agree on terms of deposition. There's like yeah, but he's the one with the right to privacy in that situation. Yeah, but I I just don't think that's like just how it works. Like oh, I decide this, and they're like no. Yeah. He, he could be like, I want to film what we're doing. 
Yeah, and then immediately you still have to the agree, and then eventually it would get taken I, to the judge because nobody would be agreeing. No, I, I actually, well, that's the thing. I think the longer that they drag that out, the worse it is on them. But again, I, I don't know if it's actually against the law for him to do something like that. I don't think it's I against think the law, is. but I think if you he think just the judge would have to agree to it, y- yeah, because they okay. wouldn't agree to it. Well, I agree, but. I think Nick would fight them tooth and nail on it just to Yeah, and I'm not I don't think the judge would end up agreeing with that either. And actually a lot of the uh, communication sounds like it's related to the GoFundMe. Um, and I I was reading some of the emails like back and forth. They're they want to know everything about the GoFundMe money. And I I honestly feel like they're in complete disbelief and they don't believe that people raised a hundred and eighty plus you know thousand dollars and then gave it to uh vic's you know legal fees Mm -hmm. the and i forget the 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 official term for it but i really do believe that they think that that money um is being messed around with and that if they can catch it if they can prove something yeah yeah and that's why i said it seems like it's a fishing expedition it's just Mm -hmm. about trying to get something on uh trying to get something on nick but i don't think that's the case at all no, it's not. But I, I think with them, they're such weaselly dishonest people that they couldn't imagine other people not being weaselly dishonest. Yeah, I mean, you're they're just projecting at that point. Mm-hmm. But they, I think they're totally convinced. It's like the person who and I. Th- this is something uh, uh, Nick had tweeted out. Um, he took the guy's name off. I don't know if he ever revealed who it was, but um, this dude says, "Well, yeah, I can imagine Vic doing it. If I were in a situation, I would have done it." Mm-hmm. And I'm just like, what? Yeah, what, <laughs> what the fuck? Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, it's yeah. I, but that, that's what I mean, right? Yeah, these people are highly immoral. They would do it. They and, just they just believe everybody else is as like mm-hmm. low, low, low scumbaggy as they are. Yeah, um, yeah. No, I, don't, I don't have anything more to say than that. I, I think if he was to pose, I think he would fight them to stream it. <laughs> Uh, Well, remember, the conversation does not end here. Tell us what you think in the comment section. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Consider sharing our content. It really helps us with the algorithm. All right. Thank you, everybody. Bye. Bye.